Hi guys, welcome. Happy Thursday. Yay, we made it nearly through the week. Tomorrow's Friday, which is great. And I have a really nice recipe for you to quickly whip up, which is fairly easy to make. Your kids can help if you want, if you're going mad and you need something for them to do. So anyway, today I am going to make sesame chicken lettuce cups, which are really nice. Now, this isn't a solid recipe. You can mix this up. You can remove the chicken and add more vegetables to make a vegetarian one. You could do it with pork, it would be really nice. You could do it with lamb, it would be really tasty. You could mix up the vegetables, make it into a more of a hot salad than a, a vegetable uh, mix like I'm doing. You could, guys, it's flexible. Do what you want with it. But I'm going to show you the basic ingredients so that you know how to do it. Now guys, don't forget to like and share and comment and talk to me because there's only so much talking I can do to myself. Uh, I've My cameraman can see the comments coming through. And so. Melanie is back. Hi Melanie, congratulations as well. Melanie won our last, I think it was, uh, prize. So that's the other thing. If you do like comment and share this video uh you could be in to win a mrs rogers prize pack so melanie won it just on from the monday one i think it was uh we gave away one last friday and yeah we've given away about four prizes over the past week we so talked to the powers that be and they have agreed that we, we can give away a lot of stuff yeah which is nice so, which is nice because we love you guys watching us and we like giving presents so that's kind of cool it is now, the Mrs. Rogers ingredients I'm gonna to use today are chili flakes, ground ginger, and sesame seeds. Now, I've got it all divided up so that I can remember what goes in where. But I am also going to show you a little trick with the sesame seeds. Now, this recipe is a lot nicer if your sesame seeds are toasted. However, Mrs. Rogers sesame seeds aren't toasted, which makes them perfect for using in anything, because let's face it, toasting them is pretty easy. So I'm just gonna show you how I very quickly, because I'm doing this entire recipe in my electric fry pan. As you guys know, love my electric fry pan. Uh, I'm gonna show you how I quickly toast my sesame seeds without turning on and wasting electricity in my oven. So, so Melanie's invited a whole bunch of uh, foodies to the video. Oh, oh right. Oh, right, that's a good idea. Thanks, awesome. Mel. You're a legend. Okay, so I am just, my fry pan's on a low heat, low to medium heat, and I've just put my sesame seeds in there. Naked, no oil, no nothing, and I'm basically just gonna brown them off. I forgot hey, my- Hey Steph, Steph's watching from hey, Steph. Auckland. Thank you for watching. So I am just toasting. This is a really quick way, Bang. oh sorry. Well, it is Chinese New Year, which is uh, of the dog uh, this year, not Chinese New Year. It is, it's a Chinese year of the dog. So that's where I thought, well, let's eat chicken. Yeah. Yeah, but that's why I'm doing a slightly Chinese inspired one. But um, yeah, so this is, you've just got to watch your sesame seeds and you'll get them browning. Uh, so it's a very low heat. Very low heat. I mean, you can do it quick in a quick heat. It's just I have to concentrate on talking as well as doing this. And I want my uh, fry pan on a fairly low heat because I don't want to broil my chicken too much. So toasting your sesame seeds does not mean putting it in the toaster does not mean putting it in the toaster. You can do it under a grill in your oven Sounds quite boring. easily. Um, even the bottom of a pot. Uh, you, if you don't have an electric fry pan like me, uh, you could absolutely do this recipe in a, in a, a large pot. That would be fine. Cool. Just gonna crank that up a little bit. So uh, we're the, using, what do you say, ground ginger? Okay, so we're gonna use ground ginger, chili flakes, and sesame seeds. Okay, excellent. So this oh. is a, this is for all of the people who have come back from Chrissy and New Year's and have gone. Yeah, I oh, need to lose some weight. I need to lose some weight. And not that oh, this will. doing shaking. Yeah, not that awesome. this will make you lose weight, guys. But it is a low sugar, low carb alternative that's going to fill you up because it's warm. Some people say, "Oh, a salad doesn't fill me up." I actually think it's because salads aren't generally warm. So this is a warm meal, which is going to fill you up and make you enjoy it more and and yeah but because we're just using good vegetables and chicken and mrs rogers products 
not only is it tasty because a lot of diet food is so bland and not tasty mm. uh, but it, it has your protein which is filling you up and you're still getting your uh, vegetable requirements for the day so it's nutritionally great not that I'm a nutritionist but I think it's pretty good and chef from Fiji from Outrigger will be very impressed because you're gonna eat it with your hands I am. I'm going to eat it Fijian style. Fijian style. Yes, when we had the, um, we spent an, an hour in the kitchen at Outrigger. We did. And we did this really nice lamb curry with uh, a whole bunch of stuff. We did lamb and pumpkin and uh, poor man's rice. Poor man's rice. Went down, went to, sat, sat, or went to sit down to eat it with a knife and fork and spoon and things. And chef's like, nah, nah. Nah, you just eat get, it with your hands. Get, just get in there with your hands. You just kind of mush it around. I should have done it more, but I yeah. felt a little bit naughty. <laughs> you know, it's like, oh, my mother would be fed very not proud of me. Right, so you're allowed to eat this with your hands. So you can eat this. Hands. This one you actually eat with your hands. Yes. Although I got in trouble a lot. We did a live a couple of months ago and I was using um, handling meat and I didn't wash my hands between oh, the meat and I got yeah. and someone commented. Oh, so. and that reminds me. Guys, I have this really nice board here that I use for all of my cutting vegetables and prep, etc. But I'm going to be really embarrassed and show you my meat cutting board. Now, I have had this for... Mm. Uh, well, we got it as a wedding present. Mel said she's going to make this. Good on you, Mel. So I think it's like 14 years this year. Mm. I don't know. So about that. So that's my tacky meat cutting board, but I love it because it's plastic. I can put it, oh, sorry about the microphone. I can put it under really hot, hot water with um, good soapy suds and know that I've got it clean. So yeah, that's that's my chicken and meat cutting board and uh, and it dries, air dries um, on the bench. Yes, because I say that the timber on your, your wood. The timber not, may absorb it depending absorb on crackiness. what it is. How's our seeds? So, They're looking good. They're looking great. So as you can see, and they smell great too. Now they do start to release a little bit of their oil, so oh, yeah. sometimes some of them get a bit they stuck. Stop. Which is actually fine, because we're going to cook our chicken in there anyway, but they'll, they will burn. So this is not only a, a nice healthy recipe, this is a one pot recipe? This, a one, this is a one pot recipe, yeah. you know how I They're love very my, popular on the internet, the old one pan one pot. One pan dinner. Hmm. or lunch or yep. brunch or whatever so as you can see I don't know if you can get in there yep. you can see through the packet there yeah and quite different very different yeah so that's nice and it gives it a, a really pretty flavor so anyway let's get to cooking chicken so that is my first handy tip of the day and stay tuned actually because I'm going to show you another handy tip that I have uh, while making things in the kitchen which is good because we're in a kitchen and we're making things yeah. so just some oil what sort if, of oil are you using? Uh, right? I'm using rice bran, you know me, that I love favorite. my rice bran oil. And I'm just going to put in now, I've finally sliced up some onion. Lovely presentation by the way. Do you like that? It's yeah. pretty. Nice. So well, that, guys, I'm just thinking, this is the kind of thing that again, with um, kids going back to school yeah. and things like that, so rather than on a Friday night being going, oh, pizza or whatever, um, you can put all of this on the table. And get the kids to make their own. Yeah. Own hey, lunch. if you want to do it with as a salad base, absolutely. As I said, yeah. I'm cooking some of these uh, ingredients. Hi, Rebecca. Rebecca from Christchurch, and she's very hot. Oh, are you, Rebecca? Oh. Go stand in the fridge. That's what I do. Get she your bag. It, she says it's very windy. Um, I think that may mean windy. Windy. Rather than windy, unless there is unless there is someone who is being no, very windy, windy today. Well, quite know. possibly. Wendy's after now are very windy. They are very windy. Yeah. Yes. Every Wendy I've known is very windy. Yep. And she's shared. Thank you for sharing. Okay, so you can just Sorry. see that I've got a little bit of colour on my onions there because oh, no. I like crispy onions. Yes. Like those too. ones that we had oh, in America yes. where they were like deep oh, fried strings, onions. Deep oh. fried onion strings? Yeah. This isn't deep this fried isn't onion no, strings. But they are thin. But it smells the same and they're very, very thin. Actually, yeah. that might be my next one. What? Oh, I just had a good idea. I'm not going to share it. Sorry. Okay. Thanks. Look out for the next live with onions. The next live with onions. Um, and I'm going it. to chuck in my grand ginger. Now I've got about two teaspoons there because ginger's nice. Two teaspoons. Of and, and that was just one of the things in Fiji. I can't even know about Fiji, but it was fun. Um, big, big ginger growing population. Some of the best ginger in the world huge, comes from Fiji. Huge, our, our ginger yeah. isn't from Fiji, but if you're looking for, um, for for ginger and you want to buy it, not pre-ground and dried like ours, then look for the Fijian ginger. 
Very okay. Nice. So now I've got um, really finely sliced chicken. I'm, hang on, look, I can do it this way. I was going to say, I'm not going to show you. That oh, kind of a slice. Yep. Finely sliced. Nice. Uh, and chuck it in there. Chuck it in there. What sort of heat have you got? It's going? just, a, it's just a, enough to sizzle. Yep. It's on a medium to low heat. And I'm just wanting to cook, start to cook that. Now, I've top. also got soy sauce. I'm wanting to put half soy sauce. Sharing is caring, Melanie. You're absolutely right. And we do appreciate it. And half fish sauce. Now, oh, don't oh. smell your fish sauce. It stinks. stinks. Does it stink of fish? Stinks of fish sauce. Uh, and um, Rebecca says it is windy. Yes. Windy, um, not windy. Oh. Yes, I heard Dunedin has been smashed by the weather. I saw that on the news this morning. It was like cars with trees through, so with a state of emergency declared in Dunedin, this might be um, a good little easy meal. I don't know easy don't meal. Know how that works. But you could do yeah. this over and, a fire. Uh, yes, uh, Wendy's partner says that um, she's cooking him dinner tonight, and this could be it. <laughs> okay, guys, so you probably sorry, didn't Wendy. see there. I, mean, I sorry, have just... Rebecca. Calling you Rebecca Wendy. Wendy. <laughs> I'm calling you Rebecca Wendy, Wendy now. Oh, oh dear. dear, it's been a long day. Sorry, um, so you may not have seen then, I actually uh, just threw in about two tablespoons of water and I'm going to pop the lid on there. And I just want so, so to... So what do we have? We have fish sauce, So we have, we have one, essentially one tablespoon of fish sauce yep. and one tablespoon of soy sauce, which is half the amount of what I've got here. Okay, and how much chicken? Uh, about 500 grams of chicken. Okay. Uh, you could do a little bit more and make your meal go further, absolutely. Mm. Yep. And and about two tablespoons of water. And I'll just Ooh, judge the how that goes. Lovely. Yeah, so I, I chuck the ginger in and cook that through with the onions mm. and the oil just to uh, get Yum. that. But anyway, guys, let's, while that's cooking, and I'm just watching my new fry pan because it really is tricking me at the moment, I'm wanting to do all the rest of it in a jar. Why a jar you say? Because I'm going to shake it. Why a jar? Why a jar? Why a jar? Oh Rebecca, sorry, just before we go, um, yes. yeah, the recipe is actually in the post. Yep. So we've At made it, we've changed the way we do things now, so the recipe's all planned and it is in the post, but you can, um, you can have, so you can have a look afterwards. Yeah. Yeah. So once the live is finished, there, your, it will already be there. there. Bam! So you can just go do and things. find stuff. Um, also, sorry, just another thing. Uh, we launched our YouTube channel yesterday. Yeah, that, that's so, really exciting. Um, so these recipes are also going to get uploaded. They get well, these videos rather get uploaded to YouTube as well, so you can watch it back on YouTube. Because sudden, sometimes it's easier to find recipes. Oh, you. you Rebecca, you can harass us as much as you want. Yeah, um, harass she, away. Harass away. Yes, yeah, so that's not harassing. On, we have no, three no. children. Yes, you can uh -uh. Um, look for it nice and easily on uh, on um, YouTube. So, oh well. So Amelia's saying that a lot of schools in town have been. Just see if I can read that. Have been closed. Wow. wow. Flip. And it's not even high tide yet, and the lost all of the coast is going. Wow. Bung. That's oh. not good. Oh, yeah. And thanks for subscribing to the YouTube channel, Amelia. Anyway, you should get yes. back to. Um, I was going to say, I've got to keep everyone. cooking, otherwise Sorry. the chicken's going to be. Yeah. Yuck. You're making. What are you doing there? So, so the rest of the soy, the rest, rest of the, the fish. Soy, so the fish. I've got a teaspoon of chili flakes. Now, guys, remember, I can't do hot, so you right. can go as chilly as you want. You can add extra chilies onto your. Oh, now anyway. this is apple cider vinegar. If, if you've got wine vinegar or white wine vinegar, you could use that. Okay. A teaspoon. Carla is famous for a Mexican salad. Oh, yum teaspoon of caster sugar mm. and a big tablespoon of sesame oil. Now this is where your oh, sesame yum. flavor is going to come, come through. through. Yeah. Hence the sesame chicken cups. Nice. And our toasted sesame seeds. Yeah. Now this is how I always Quite make dressings. Oh, look at that. And just because I like to be tidy I'm just going to go like that. Now as you can see my chicken sizzling. I'm managing to cook with two hands which is awesome. Now I want to throw in my carrots. So you're putting the carrots in the, the, oh, carrots in with in. the okay, good. And with the chicken, I'm just wanting to. For all the kids the out there that are going to watch this, um, those are called vegetables. Vegetables, mm -hmm. orange vegetables. Orange those vegetables, are lots of color. I'm also throwing in my zucchini. And you have finely diced all of this. Now I have julienne it. Julienne. But I do have a julienne machine, so I haven't What's sat there spain, painstakingly. You, should, you shouldn't have told everyone that. You should have said that you. Yeah, no. No, okay. They're so cheap now, guys. If you if you like that sort of look for your salads and things. Okay, julienne. Julienne away. And now, it looks like lovely, yeah. 
I have got some crazy mushrooms. I'm not going to give a prize, but if anybody can find out what those mushrooms are called, that would be awesome. Do you know what they are? No, no I forgot. Okay. I forgot. I was going to look it up. There's but but that was it, that was even a thing. The, the supermarket it was it was a pack of crazy mushrooms for three crazy, bucks. Crazy mushrooms. Yeah. Well, they were marked down because we've got to eat them. Yeah, yeah. And um, Rebecca said she was about to ask the way that you cut them. So yes, using a cheap yeah. machine that you probably it's bought like it one of those things that you flick and you go and, like that. Yeah. A warehouse special for five bucks. I don't know. I got it. No, it wasn't that cheap. Oh, okay. but Six it, sorry, banging my. So anyway, I'm just wanting to warm all of that through. And you'll see that I've left two of the vegetables still because I hate floppy capsicum and I hate floppy mung beans. Yeah, I'm not a big but the vegetables player. I've chosen, I've chosen them on colour. Yep. So I've tried to get a good variety of colour. Now you could do it as a salad and do um, like tomatoes and carrots and cucumber, capsicum, you know, all of that, whatever you like in your Thing. salad. So just for people who are joining us, we're making yeah. sesame chicken cups. This is a really, really good, easy recipe to make. Um, that can is be hot or cold. Hot or cold, yeah. And just, just a good replacement, <coughs> takeaway replacement, essentially. It is. Yeah. Look at that. And it makes a lot. When you it bulk does. it out with the vegetables, that's a heck of a lot. Mm -hmm. So it's okay. lunch and dinner. So, yeah, pretty much. And I'm going to, well, this is a family meal, you yeah, know. Yeah. So I'm just, so I'm going not going to build it, I'm just going to do this, okay. because I just want those vegetables to have a little party. Nice. And because you've thinly sliced the uh, chicken, the... Um, it's cooked. It's cooked. Yeah. Yeah, well done. So it is really quick, everybody. I'm just going to, I'm not going to fit all of it in here, I don't think. I forgot to get a big bowl. Never mind. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Because now, it looks uh, lovely. No, I'm not going to. So now, what you want to do? So while you're multitasking, you're multitasking, making was. the dressing. You don't want a heap of the dressing, just some. Now this is why I say it could be a salad as well, because you actually do have like a hot dressing on How there. How good does that look? I'm going to turn I'm off the. Going to turn go. that off so Hold it on. stops cooking. Okay, so lettuce cups. Now, lettuce isn't your friend really when it comes to making lettuce cups. What? Lettuce is not your friend? Lettuce is not your friend when it as opposed to is, lettuce is that you opposed to looking good. Salad. You would pretty much have to pull a whole lettuce apart I reckon to get a good cup and it's easier to get the, the cup shape closer towards the centre of the lettuce than the outside. However, I wasn't going to pull my lettuce apart just to yeah. get you guys a cup. So you can... Very rude. You should, I know. should have made the I know. I know. Anyway, so you... Can. Rebecca, oh, sorry, Rebecca can says you're just going to use wraps. Yeah. Yeah, well, well that's the thing. You could use those yeah. rice wraps. You could use anything. Yeah. We're trying to do it slightly low carb. We're trying to do a low carb thing because that's Carla is craving. Yeah, well, it's easy, Carla. This is easy stuff. This is so it? easy. Look at that. That looks good. So look at that. Look at that. Hey, do like our, I don't know if anyone can hear our funky music in the background. We always felt it was a bit quiet, so we've added funky music in. <laughs> We're going to have a little dance party. Yeah. So, guys. That, oh, is that it? That's it. Oh. That's my chicken wrap. Obviously, I've got heaps left over to make Yum. a couple for everybody in the family. Yum, says Mel. And, um, yeah, uh, but I'm going to give you a challenge to eat this without getting it all down your face and oh, over your clothes. How about okay. that? Uh, Rebecca says we've got to turn the music up. Okay, we'll turn that up next time. I wasn't, I'm never sure. Okay, here we go. Yeah, because otherwise I'm yelling. Yelling over the top. Fiji star. Okay. Delish, says Amelia. Get in there. <laughs> that's a good look. <laughs> mm. Mung bean hanging out your face. Yum. That does look nice. Mm. Look at that. Look at all the colours. Look at all the chicken. The chicken looks nice and tender. Chicken's beautiful. Easy to make. So they get yeah. So Carla can see the colour. It does look mm. clear. Yeah. Yeah. If you serve that up for a Friday afternoon, you know, evening sort of a um, meal, everyone would be happy about that. Well and it's done. so easy to make. And you can adjust it. You can add more chili. Less chilly. Yep. Uh, from a heat <laughs> point of view. Rebecca says that um, you, you did well. Her just goes everywhere. Yeah. I'm oh, the same yeah. Way. Thanks. Um, oh, and yeah. Alana is in Omaru and it's raining. Mm, yeah, it's a bit cloudy outside yeah. my window today Sorry too. It's that. a bit Can't do much better cold weather. and bare. While I'm inside cooking. Well, that was summer. Everyone enjoyed so, it. Good. So, guys, that, that was um, 
That was my really easy quick sesame chicken wraps. Sesame recipe cups. Ses yeah, what, chicken, uh, yeah. Sesame well, chicken wraps. Sesame chicken, chicken lettuce, lettuce cups. Lettuce cups. But as as um, someone suggested, you could put it in a wrap. You could put it in um, what are those half yeah. a bread Thanks, things. Carla. Pita bread. Yeah. You could uh, you could actually just put that on top of rice if you wanted to because it's kind yeah, of a yeah, stir you could fry. Actually, but um, a second day meal would be fantastic. Second oh, day lunch would be brilliant for the office. Be, just take that and make absolutely. up a big batch and take it in. Yeah. 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 And yeah, so guys, real quick and easy. And as I said, you can either have it vegetable based or salad based. Yep. If you were going to do it uh, salad based, obviously you wouldn't cook your salad. You just cook the chicken and the onion. Yep, flavor for miles. Yeah. Oh, and Amelia reckons the kids will even eat it. I <laughs> think so too, Amelia. I'm actually very interested to see. Uh, I think mine might as well. Maybe without the chili. Let's see, we go. So anyway, we'll see. but anyway, guys, like and share, please. Like, you share, comment, go in to win. If you come in and share, people do actually win, as uh, Melanie can attest Melanie to, because she entered where we had a competition with about five entries, so <laughs> she's yeah. done very well. So guys, like and share, uh, and uh, and your comments are very welcome. And go and have a look at our YouTube channel. We are really interested in feedback, and subscribe because all of this sort of stuff is going to go up there but there are within the next month there are going to be a few specific youtube mrs rogers uh videos going up so yeah really excited exciting times busy times school is either back or going back tomorrow depending on the age of your children alana says the youtube channel is amazing thanks alana thanks alana that's good that was that Thank was you. the uh entire christmas time <laughs> Yeah, However, that's like. okay. It's fun. But yeah, guys, hey, and also if you do make this, but wait, because more. at least one person said I'm going to make this, can you please Thanks take a, a photo and share it? Yeah, we'd love I'd to see I love to see, like, especially if you've done it with a wrap or with rice yeah. or something different um, or exactly the same, mm -hmm. share it because, yeah, I'd love to see. I'm just an at-home mum, yeah. essentially, and uh, love cooking. So, yeah. so any inspiration that we yeah. can get, that we can share um, yeah. back, that would be great. Absolutely. Melanie reckons the food wouldn't last a second day. Yeah, I think you're right. Well, mm. yeah. Yeah, you're probably right. Probably right. Well done. Enjoy. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Thanks for commenting, Alana, and everyone else. And commenting Mel and, and being Win our friends. Wendy. And Wendy. <laughs> Wendy. AKA, what was Wendy's real name? Somebody. I'm sorry. I've forgotten now. <laughs> anyway. Anyway, guys, <laughs> have a happy Thursday. Have a glass of wine or a beer because you've done well to get this far. Uh, oh, long weekend. Long weekend. Waitangi. Is it? Because well, Waitangi Day is Tuesday. I, get I can't remember. I because we I'm work I'm going to call it day. a long weekend. Yeah. Yeah. It was Rebecca. I'm oh, Rebecca. Sorry, Rebecca. Rebecca, aka Wendy. Well done. Yeah. Excellent. So anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Um, Enjoy and the weekend. Yeah. I'm going to go and eat this late See lunch. Bye. See ya. Bye. Bye.